there's been testimony around the around that picture that Mr. Depp fell asleep with ice cream in his hand. That's not vomitous, right? I, I was told it was vomitous. Okay. Um, you talked about the fact that Mr. Depp uh, indicates that from time to time he uses an earpiece. I was, yeah, I mean, I, I read that, yes. Okay. Um, did you read the testimony of Mr. Wyatt, who told you what was being pumped into that earpiece? Yeah, I mean, if I, if I remember right, I mean, it was, I think it was lines, right? No, it was music. It was music, not his line? Yeah. Oh, okay. So if, if Mr. Depp was listening to music rather than being fed his lines, does that change your opinion as to his cognitive function? If he was never fed his lines through the earpiece, which I know he was, but read he was, and that may have been that example, Mr. White may have said that it was music. I guess the question is, were you having the music during the during the actual talking of your lines, is that what you're saying to me? Well, you know, if if you can do two things at once, that's a pretty high cognitive function, isn't it, sir? You know, it's a very good point. Actually, divided attention is something humans have a lot of trouble in. Yeah. So, for instance, we have trouble driving and putting on the, you know, using our uh, cell phones and direct. So, divided attention, humans actually are not very good at. I'll, yeah. I'll put that out there. But, but Mr. In general, not but, just Mr. Depp in general. But, but Mr. Depp is pretty good at acting. You. you you acknowledge that early on. Absolutely. Well, better than me, so I know that. Because you don't act. In fact, you don't know about acting. You're right. I have no okay. idea about acting. And you don't know how prevalent the use of earpieces are in acting. Again, I, do, I, I know nothing about acting. Irrespective of the fact you know nothing about acting, you've testified that Mr. Depp's use of an earpiece is somehow a cognitive deficit? So if I was giving a lecture and I was fed my lines, I would think there's a cognitive deficit. So I'm, and maybe I'm wrong. Like I said, maybe I could be wrong. Maybe Hollywood stars get lines fed to them through earpieces all the time, and I, I don't know. I, I, that could be said. It sounded to me to be unusual if you're doing a movie and you don't know the lines. But like you said, I'm just judging into what I do with lectures, and uh, that would never happen. If you gave lectures, you wouldn't use an earpiece, but you're not going to tell anybody how to act. I'm sorry, what was the question? I, I said if you gave lectures, you wouldn't use an earpiece, but you're not telling anybody how to act. Right, I would not use an earpiece during lectures. Right. But I, again, I don't know what the standard for a care of Hollywood, standard as Hollywood is for that. I have no idea. Your use, uh, your testimony about the use of an earpiece as uh, maybe you were wrong, you're comfortable with the fact that you may have made a mistake there? No, because I think in the basis of what I've read about it, I'm comfortable that I, I don't believe that actors are routinely given their entire script through earpieces. I find that hard to believe. Yeah, but, and, and but not one whit of evidence that ever, this ever happened I, here. I guess what I said, I just said, I find it hard to believe. I didn't say it. Ha I said, I find it hard to believe. That's all I said. Oh, yeah, but what you found hard to believe, sir, was that every, every line of the script was, was pumped through an earpiece. Where did you ever get the idea that ever that occurred? That's what I have been, that's what I read in the uh, court review, the court evidence. That's where I got it from. Right, right. And, um, you know whether Marlon Brando used an earpiece? Whether, isn't he dead? <laughs> yeah. So the answer is no, he does not use one now. Oh, no, I, I, I used the past tense. So. Oh, I'm sorry. Uh, I, again, I know nothing, I will concede to you, I know nothing about acting. I will concede to you 100%. If that is the standard and people are done that acting, then I apologize and that was wrong on my part. If that's the standard, I'm wrong. I don't know. Okay. Let's go with that. No further questions. All right. How long is your redo? A, a, a bit. You may want to take a All right. Let's go ahead and break for lunch then, ladies and gentlemen. Again, do not do any outside research. Do not discuss your testimony with anybody, okay?